Hello, welcome back to RJ Outdoors. Hopefully you can see me okay. <laughs> Treating myself to a, uh, a new camera. Um, catch up with me today. Oh, hang on. Do it! Oh, hang on, I lost my dog. Do it! Here she come. Uh, you catch up with me today. Sorry if that was a bit loud. <laughs> you catch up with me today in uh, my local woods. Um, this is like, a, like an overview slash review video. Um, I bought a, uh, a new camping kettle, um, outdoors kettle, off Timu of all places. Um, cost me about seven quid, eight quid. Um, we'll look at that when we get over. Um, yeah, and this is basically a uh, review slash overview video of my first use of said kettle. Um, I had quite a, quite a lot of messages, which is quite rare, on Instagram from different loads of different people saying, oh, that looks cool, blah, blah, blah. Um, I think it's sold out now, but no, you know what team moves like. It'll be back. Um, basically, yeah, I had a silly amount of uh, messages from people. So I said to, said to everyone that I'll get out and uh, make a little video of me using it. So here I am. Um, I'm just making my way through the foliage to my little spot and then we'll get it set up. I've got a spirit burner today. Um, I'm in public woods, I don't really like fires, but um, yeah, we'll get it, uh, get the spirit burner going. It's raining. I wasn't promised rain when I looked on the weather. Oh, this will do, this little clearing. Found the dog, she's there. Let's get this kettle on the boil, give it a little tester. There she is. So it says she's an enamel kettle, camping kettle, um, 1.7 litres, obviously you get a lid. But yeah, long life made apparently. Made in China obviously. But yeah, let's uh, get it on the boil and let it brew. Right, so I've got my uh, coffee set up. I'm on this at the moment. Uh, Beacon's coffee from Wales. Chill your adventure. Endurance. It's a strong old brew. Trust me, if you like your coffee, get on it. Uh, check them out on Instagram. Nice guy as well. Got my cup. Got my filter. So, it's been on for about three minutes. Yeah, we're, we're boiling. Um, it is starting to smell a bit, um, but I'm guessing that's just flame on paint, not any kettle after the first burn, but we'll see. Obviously it's advertised as a camping kettle, like everything. I'm... Oh, I'll fuck it that up now, don't I? Alright. Bear with me. Yeah, so we obviously it's it, it's advertised as a um, as a camping kettle, um, but if it's used for a camping kettle, is it meant to be used as a camping kettle? Because we all know what Timu in China's like. Um, why why that's burning <laughs> slash boiling? I'm quickly going to get it up on my phone. Timu, that is. Uh, and see how the price because I got it when there was a voucher. Uh, voucher, voucher, uh, orders, orders. Yeah, so I got it when it was a voucher. Oh, I've got signal. Uh, oh, here we go. Yeah, so it's 14 quid at the minute, but when I bought it, it was seven. Meant to be 57 quid, if you believe that. Yeah, £7.79. That's what I paid for it. If my camera can uh, zoom. 
Yeah. yeah, that's what I paid for it. We've got a boil, ladies and gentlemen. We have got a boil. It'll take a nice big spoonful of coffee. Oh, the smell! Incredible. She's a bit bant, but we'll deal with that as and when. That little filter I've got this one. I got this from Timo as well. <laughs> it's a it's a drip alert. Well, it's meant to drip, but it's coming up more like a stream at the minute. thing we'll let this cool down and then I'll come back to it coffee's done metal cup very hot as you can see I've got a well balanced diet pork pie I'm just eating one these little donut things kettle so we'll look at that in a sec and obviously me coffee I'm not being posh. Slam my finger in a door. That endurance coffee is good. Especially for someone like me who just drinks black coffee. No sugar. Obviously no milk. Strong coffee. Alright, let's look at this kettle. Because she's cooled down now. Let's look at the... Uh, so, we've got burn marks, yes, because we're on top of a flame. We have, excuse me, it's a pot pie. Um, we haven't, look, that's my finger. I should have bought a piece of tissue, really. <laughs> that's my dirty finger from the bits and bobs I've been doing. But look, if you wipe it, nothing's coming off. The paint hasn't melted. All right, the paint hasn't melted. It's enamel, apparently. Brilliant little bit of workmanship there, isn't it? Um, but yeah, for seven pound, a enamel kettle, which seems to have been okay. You know, I've got no obvious damage. Yeah, I've only had it for like a week, and this is the first time I've used it. So maybe I should do one in like a year's time because I probably will use it quite a lot outside because it looks really cool, doesn't it? It looks really cool. And it makes a nice coffee, but then that might that's not that because it's water in there. So if, if boiled water tastes like anything, but it doesn't because you need your in, endurance coffee and your pork pies and your little donut pop things. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. This video is more of a test of me testing out my new GoPro because I can't wait. Um, I've got videos planned, etc. Yada 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 blah blah blah. blah. So. I just wanted to get out and uh, use my GoPro. Obviously, let everyone see what the kettle's like. If you heard that squeak, that was my shoe, because the dog is now looking, thinking it was something else. You got anything you want to say, Poochie? She's got a bowl, look. Uh, I'll say thanks very much for watching. She's more interested in the squirrels. Anyway, thanks very much for watching. I'm going to eat these pork pies and these donuts and I'm going to head off home. See you all soon.